morning vlog good morning 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 it is october 31st it's halloween and before y'all ask nope i'm not dressing up for halloween i'm not i don't have any halloween plans um we're not going trick-or-treating <sighs> i was gonna cook and like i'm probably still gonna cook actually because we gotta eat but as far as any Halloween plans, we don't have Halloween plans. It's too many crazy things going on these days. People be crazy. It's a lot going on. And just not this year. Not, not this year. Not this year. Tiana's costume is supposed to be here today. So hopefully it comes on time. Y'all know I'm a last minute parent. I'm not the parent that have it all together. I'm a very last minute person, period. I'm like last minute not even just parent like period I'm last minute so we're waiting on the costume hopefully it comes today but like we're not doing anything and we don't even eat can't like I eat candy but I don't let Tiana eat candy because like cavities and shit and like it's just I don't know I'm just not in the Halloween spirit I'm ready for Christmas okay <laughs> so I'm just not in the Halloween spirit, but I don't want to take that away from Tiana. Y'all know she went to that um, Halloween party on Saturday, so she did do something for Halloween. And I was going to take her to a haunted house that day just so we could do something in the Halloween spirit. But it's just too much going on these days. Halloween is on a Monday. I don't really think anybody's going to really have their trick-or-treating doors. I mean, trick-or-treating stuff out. We got like one house in our neighborhood that's like decorated for Halloween. So I might let her go knock over there or whatever. But we're still not going to eat the candy. So <laughs> I don't know. Like, it's not really any point. I'm in a hella grumpy ass mood this morning. <laughs> I've been like snapping on everybody. It's crazy. Um, I don't know why I'm so grumpy this morning, but we're grumpy. Happy third trimester. I'm in my third trimester. 20. Hey, son, why can't I help you with? Can you go outside? That's what you need to do? Outside? Come on. It's just me like if you know me you know I'm moody as hell anyway so like I just have my moments like where I'm grumpy and then I'm like nice and that's just me like I don't know I don't know so being pregnant makes it worse but I do be feeling bad like you know I be feeling bad not me gonna bring the bag because I'm hungry but I wasn't gonna do a weekly vlog this week honestly y'all I was going to do Fat ass piece. <laughs> you know what? That was miserable. And that was all because I see hair in my food. And it's my hair. And I know it's my hair. I know it's my hair because it looked like my hair. And I washed my bowl out. I rinsed my bowl out before I even used it. I have this big phobia of like hair and food, even my hair. Mm -mm. So. Oh my God, I cannot make this up. I feel like shit. <laughs> This has got to be a joke, right? Because uh, I was just okay. But I feel sick. I don't know if it's I need to eat or I don't know what it is. But I feel like lightheaded and mm, I ain't did nothing but clean the drawers out. I got through one drawer. Oh, uh-uh, something. 
Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay. Oh. Ow, ow, ow. Mm. Mm. Um, are these Braxton Hicks? Because chow boo. I don't know if these are like fucking diarrhea paints or like Braxton Hicks paints. I don't hurt that bad, y'all. I'm just dramatic, okay? And I hate pain. Who is going natural? I'm not going to. Oh, I hate any type of discomfort. I hate it. And I just want to ball up in a ball and contain the contain the pain. Oh, oh my God. I'm wearing a hat. I had to take a nap after that little episode of stomach pains after I picked Tiana. Yeah, it was nap time for me. And now I'm just getting dressed just to go take some pictures. I'm actually going to put on what I'm going to wear to go take the pictures. So I'm going to put that on and then I'm going to be right back so we can put my face on and then go about our business. Okay, y'all. I'm getting ready to take pictures. Mm, I look like I'm gonna go grocery shopping. Hot mom. I'm so ready to be done being pregnant, y'all. I'm ready to push this baby. First of all, I had a Braxton Hicks contraction earlier. Mm -hmm. I say, oh, natural who? Uh oh. Natural who? 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 I'm gonna go in there and say, give me everything you got. Give me. They said you can take Benadryl though. Like, so you can like sleep. Oh. And I said, oh my God, I'm not gonna be able to sleep. But they said they put in your IV, so like you'd be like, oh. it hits you. Mm -hmm. no, like so I was like, okay, 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 okay. Happy Halloween, y'all. We ain't got no Halloween festivities. I said I was gonna dress up. Tiana costume ain't come. We didn't even know if her costume came because we didn't check the mail. <laughs> I thought that she would have checked it, but she didn't. So, um, yeah. Oh, this is embarrassing. People is driving by. She'll catch up on the AR, how you did that? Check out lift up when you take off, how you did that? You put switches up, all your bleakings, how you did that? Your LV bed turned to a legit, how you did that? I seen that back turn to a Louis, how you did that? Oh, my ass is out. Alright y'all, I think I'm gonna take a picture at the club. Guess where I'm at y'all. Just guess. Vegas? 
tell them where we at? So I'm pregnant. <laughs> I'm talking about I'm pregnant. Y'all already know I'm pregnant. I'm having a lot of emotions right now. So I'm watching this girl's vlog. Her name is Jordan Ari. And she just had a baby. And she did it natural. And I'm getting emotional because it is just like very peaceful and beautiful. The way that she is like. Don't hear her humming. <laughs> the way she is like handling the pain through her birth like y'all see me early I'm dramatic and I don't want to put it in my head that I can't do natural birth but like I am mean I am mean and I just don't I don't think I'll have this much support for a natural birth I probably should look into getting like a doula because I'm terrified. I'm terrified. Do y'all see my face? My camera gonna die, y'all. I am terrified. If you wanna know how to do something, literally Google it. Like Google is our best friend, okay? Um, but I am getting ready to go get Tiana. It is 2.43, I actually just got done, let me wash my face first. I just got done taking a shower because I just got done cleaning. It's November 1st and I look a mess. We starting off November 1st always looking a mess. Like, I, let's, I need a dollar for how many times I say I look a mess today. Like, I don't know what's going on with my skin, but it burns my lip is burning do y'all see where it's turning red at it's burning this fucking spot on my face <laughs> okay my eye I can't be great clearly I had a story time to tell y'all right I was just in a shower and I was literally thinking I was like oh my gosh so I feel like this like something under my arm i don't know right but i pay attention to my body so it's very important to pay attention to your body y'all like any part of your body when you feel like something's off or you feel like something's wrong go get it checked out it's better to be safe than sorry the last thing you want to do is not get something checked out and then wait a long time and boom it's something wrong it's something under my arm and it's hurting a little bit and like i don't know it could I'm just thinking like because I'd be really scrubbing my arms because I was like oh my god my armpits are getting darker um they're hairy right now but they're getting darker um I got some ingrowns and I was like maybe I'm just tripping but like when I feel it it's something that is not it just hurts so I'm gonna go get it checked out but what made me think about this story was I remember um saying like oh my gosh like my boobs like when I lay back I feel something like like I feel something it don't feel right and I was very concerned middle of April end of April I made my appointment to go get my boobs checked so they made me an appointment I went to the doctor she checked it and she was like she does like it feels tender and she doesn't really feel she doesn't feel anything exactly but she it doesn't feel like the same as the other one so um she gave me a referral to go see another doctor and get uh what are those the breast thing a mammogram i think that's what it's called get one of those done okay i went and got it done like in may when i say my period still hadn't came on so at this point my period didn't come on a week late and so i was like okay when i went into the doctor's office to get the mammogram done instead of doing an x-ray they just felt on my breast and did an ultrasound because on the paper i wrote and said they said is it a chance that i could be pregnant and i put yes and i only put yes because my period didn't come on and so i'm like okay really i'm like okay i mean it's like a slim chance that i could be pregnant but it's a chance i get the test done or whatever everything comes back fine nothing's wrong my breasts are good and i was so happy i was like relief because i was in there shaking y'all i was in that 
doctor's office shaking I was by myself I was really scared I didn't know like what was going on I didn't know what to expect you know like normally I don't know what age they make you wait to get breast mammograms done but you know I knew it wasn't 21 so I leave and I'm all happy and I'm like yes you know what I'm saying boom everything's good now I'm sitting here thinking back y'all y'all nephew got me going to get a, a breast mammogram done because he making my breast hurt and it was hurting it was tender like it was hurting too so I was like oh my god now I went and got a whole breast thing done and whole time I'm pregnant but y'all pay attention to stuff like that pay attention to your body but also like that's just crazy isn't that crazy because I didn't know if I was pregnant at the time that I put that on that paper but did I jinx myself probably <laughs> I be feeling like I jinx myself all the time so today is November 1st and I feel good I feel real good I was up surprisingly all night and then I got some coffee and I cleaned up and I didn't go to sleep because really when I got home this morning I really wanted to go to sleep really really bad right as I had just got home at like nine something and so I was like I want to go to sleep I'm, I'm tired y'all I said no it is November 1st we're gonna get our shit together I did good in October okay Y'all know I usually be done quit, and I know I say this every vlog, but it's just really the personal growth for me. Like, I feel like I kind of lost my passion for YouTube because it was kind of becoming too stressful. Like, it was becoming, like, a job, and even though, like, that's okay, like, I want this to be my job. You know, this is what I, this is what I want. This is what I want to do. I love doing this. I love talking to you guys. I love getting new supporters. I love being able to tell my story. I love being able to have young women relate to me. I love this so much. But once something becomes, once it starts like sucking the joy out of it, then it kind of becomes like, like a nine to five job, you know, something that you don't really enjoy doing. If you kind of lose your passion for it, and so I felt like that's kind of how I was. I kind of lost my passion for it, but I have found it again. I don't know how, but I've been feeling good. October was a really good month for me, like business wise, emotional wise, child, emotional wise, October can go to hell, literally. Okay. But business wise in October, great. Like. When I say great, I mean great. And I still have my moments, y'all. Don't get me wrong now, because y'all know I was just crying last week. I cry all the time, still. But now it's to the point where I'm like, okay, if you want to be happy, girl, you are got to make yourself happy. Like, you can't depend on nobody else to be making you happy. Happiness is, do you want to be happy? That's the question. Do you want to be happy? Because if you want to be happy, go make your motherfucking self happy and create your own happiness it is nobody else's job or responsibility to make you happy okay that's what i had to learn if y'all are reading this i hope i could give you guys a little inspiration you know to give yourself give yourself that extra push push yourself because we're not always gonna have somebody else there to push us to guide us it's up to you to change your life if you want a difference in your life you have to change it i say all of that to say today I chose to get stuff done instead of going to sleep. I'm gonna start this month off right. I usually start the month like days later. Y'all know, I did it last month. Started the month days later and let me go get the edge control. Y'all already know my edge control linked in the bottom, period. But y'all know I usually start the month like days later, ain't got no plan. I already actually wrote out my content for the month. I just need to plan when am I going to film these videos. I have yet to write my goals for November, but I'm gonna get that done today. Probably in a minute, me and Tiana are gonna go to the park. 
just to get out the house and spend some quality time together and I don't want to bore bore y'all talking too much so I'm going to finish getting ready I'm putting the hat on so this don't even matter I'm gonna finish getting ready and then I'm gonna go to first of all let me tell y'all how Tiana some little boy gonna say bye girlfriend no he's in fourth grade I'm telling your dad fourth grade is she lying too? He's in fourth grade. Does she keep saying he in fourth grade? He is. And what grade you in? Third. Not fourth. So if he was in the third grade, then it would make it okay? No. So then what you saying then? Well, I what? It. I broke it. <laughs> I'm finna tell her dad. Cause what he talking about by girlfriend? He said girl. Mm-mm. No, he didn't. I yes, heard. he did. I heard him. I, I got bad hair. Take that attitude you. out your voice before I knock you out. Period. Thank you. Anyway, y'all. I will snatch your hair. Yeah, I'm gonna snatch your little hair that's on your head. She a catch up on the AR. How you did that? Check out the book. The baby is almost seven months. Which means he is one. Two months. Yeah, they know two months left. Yeah. 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 If you know, you know. If you don't, boo. <laughs> been a good day. like one of those dogs from um, pets. The secret life of pets. You know what I'm talking about? Look at it walking. So I actually I kind of got some got somewhere okay so I got somewhere with my they don't look like it but these are my clothes my old clothes that 
I can no longer fit and like summer clothes and stuff like that and then I need to fold these and put those up and that's what the closet look like now which is way better than it was looking honestly I need to go through and organize it a little bit but we have some space here lots of space and um yeah i'm gonna finish going through it i got some clothes in there and like bags and stuff that i need to take out so i'm gonna do that um i'm real thirsty though okay right, so i got this water bottle sent to me today from belly bottle okay and we're just gonna open it on camera. So don't be so dark. Oh, that's cute. You can show the ball. Congrats on are you gonna read it? Mm -hmm. Congrats on your pregnancy. We're so excited for you. Wishing you a smooth journey and safe delivery. We hope this bottle can help along the way. That's a bad thing. Okay, y'all, so it has the weeks and stuff on there. So I'm real far already, so. But we're gonna catch up and we're gonna do them. Helps you keep progress of your. Oh, I need this because you know what? I really be forgetting how many weeks I be. <gasps> I be seeing that, actually. I'll fold my plate, guys. Let me see. So, this is. Okay, y'all, so it also has the times on it, which y'all can't see, but it has the times on it. I should put the stickers on first. And then yeah. Okay. He's getting big. Where's week 28? I'm scared. Third semester. Third trimester, not semester. Trim semester. Trimester. Yeah. And they just put all the stickers from up here. Mm -hmm. hmm. Chris. Chris. Hey, thanks so much for me in. Cut the light. Yo, TC got mini Uno. Show them. Isn't it so cute? It's so cute. Ooh, I can play Uno with the baby. <laughs> so Ooh, this is what it looks like, okay, y'all? This is so small. You guys like my stuff. We're gonna play Uno and I know. A win. <laughs> Yeah. You're supposed to make tacos. I'm gonna win Uno. I thought we were gonna play Uno. Huh? I thought we were gonna play Uno. Yeah, I know. After. Shuffle cards? I'm just gonna shuffle. I'm not gonna actually. I'm gonna post the baby tacos. I'm gonna make them. I don't wanna like actual shuffle, shuffle them, so I'm just. Oh, you know what? Oh my gosh, y'all. Yeah. Oh my god, Chris, who's talking to you? 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 I didn't even show y'all my belly band. Let me show y'all. So I got my belly, I don't think I showed y'all, but let me show y'all. I got my belly band, right? And I'll link it in my Amazon storefront if y'all want. It's very cool. Like, really cool. But it helps so much. It helps like whenever she wants one to be to lift the baby. I don't have to do it anymore because of this. <sighs> it's already lifted. Y'all, I don't know why the light is so shitty. So y'all can see it better. And then it also comes with another part. Let me show y'all the other part. We measured my stomach, but I got a large. So this is a large. So it also come with this part too. 
So we put it on the back like that. And then like this. And y'all, it really lifts. It lifts it a lot. It feels like so much pressure from here lifted up. Yes. You like it. So who's going first? I don't want your money. I bought this just for you. Keep your money. I don't, you can go first. I don't want your money. I right, so? Draw one. I know. No. <laughs> This girl cheated. <laughs> no, I didn't have. Cause how we only got pink half. and you ain't even shuffle good. I only had green and blue. Me too. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. No way. I had oh, only had green and blue and I beat her that easy. That's crazy. She okay. cheated. This time we gonna have 10 cards and you'll have enough. Mm -mm, we're going seven. We're going eight. It's red. It's red. It's red. It's red. Y'all look. It's red. It's red. Most definitely, it's red. It's red. I, your color is red. I bet your last one is red. You think so? Yes. You think so? Yes. I really think so. Mm. I think so. You got money on that? What? Bam. <laughs> so I could have did this. Ah, uh, gotcha. I could have did this. You could have. I could have did this. Or what are these? Yep. Too bad. I won't play again. Nope. Come on. Come nope. on. No, and why you throw them like that? Hey, y'all. I literally just, well, I didn't just get back, but I've been back for about 30 minutes now. I went to dinner. I'll insert a clip from dinner because I did not vlog. Um, went to spend some quality time. My stomach is hurting. Like, it's hurting on this side. Like, it's stretching really bad. And I don't know, y'all. I was just thinking and like I'm not feeling satisfied with my body like I feel like I mean okay like I'm pregnant I know I'm pregnant and I have my moments but right now I'm just not having a good moment because I just miss my old body I feel fat and not cute and I don't like feeling like this I feel stretched out but I think about how I'm doing it for a good cause. <laughs> I'm growing my son. So for him, I will let him, allow him to stretch me out. Okay. But I just, it's a lot. Pregnancy is a lot. Pregnancy was not like this for me the first time. I didn't have the complaints or the sadness of my body changing, but I do. Now, hmm, I'm sad. And I have to be careful because I have my tracker on. I probably should have took it off. What tracker? What's that for? Hmm. It's for my Oh. That's what you do when you be streaming? Sometimes. What, you, what do that do? It tracks my body. How can I see it? I have like a 3D avatar. Oh, like, oh no, she wasn't doing that. Cat. Oh, <laughs> well, she had a mask on, but. From Euphoria. It's like a 3D avatar. I'm That's cool. And you move and it moves. Mm -hmm. That's what you see, and you see it on Twitch. Mm -hmm. You streaming tonight? Yeah. I'm gonna have to look. Let me go make my account. I'm gonna have to look and see. I didn't know it did that. Good morning, guys. Good morning. So, I say this every morning. I look a mess. Y'all know. So, I'm sitting down answering emails, but I'm trying to 
like edit this video but y'all i got this right i really don't know how to use it and honestly he explained it how do you he explained it to me 10 times how to use this he said it's supposed to make it fast better so i don't know i'm gonna plug it up and try to use it it's a portable ssd um this is what it looks like okay all i know is he told me that it's supposed to make it work faster so i'm gonna plug it up in here and i'm gonna try to use it i also have this one but this is a cheaper one um i bought this i bought the cheaper one and then he went and bought this one i don't know how much this costs i forget what i was coming on here to say so once i remember i'll be back y'all my stomach is <laughs> i think my stomach growling but i can't tell we that's us we hungry honey are we hungry it be him moving every time hey vlog so <clears throat> i'm currently eating pizza rolls i honestly before i just cut this camera on before i've been eating my pizza rolls i was feeling so sick honestly i've been feeling lightheaded ever since i got out the shower but aside from feeling lightheaded I just, I started just shaking out of nowhere. I don't know what is going on. Um, maybe I was hungry, but I ate. So, I don't know. I'm feeling okay right now, though. And let me tell y'all about y'all nephew kicking me at my ribs, y'all. He is, he's growing because this boy been kicking me in my ribs and i've never experienced that when pregnant with tiana so like i'll be trying to push him out the way like move mm -mm. my little baby said it's getting it's getting um stuffed up in here he can't say that because he got two more months okay i have been cleaning so let me show y'all the update on the closet right because do y'all remember the closet and it had all this stuff in it and it just looked a mess mess so i did something you know like it's something something got done i did the best that i could do okay i got all my pregnancy my pre-pregnancy clothes out and all the shoes that i don't wear and it's looking much better much better i had to throw away some shoe boxes because yeah so i got this i moved this right but i don't know where am i gonna put it i think i'm gonna put it out of the room because I don't really use the stuff that's in it. Um, Y'all, I don't, really don't want to show my face because I look a mess. But yeah, I just wanted to come and show y'all that. I'm trying to get some stuff done, okay? I just got out the shower, right? But y'all know I have to give y'all bump updates. Just look at him. I want to cry, y'all, because this was just my baby. This was just my baby, June, and now look at him. I know we haven't talked much this vlog, y'all, for our 28 week vlog because I have just been feeling very much pregnant. Um, I'm tired guys I'm out of breath more I I'm just getting on up there <laughs> when it comes to the pregnancy it's we're getting on up there guys we're getting on up there I can't even lie to you we gotta stay hydrated maybe need some water I enjoy this water bottle, y'all, but I'm so spoiled by my coldest water bottles that like, I'm so used to the water staying cold. Like I don't have to refill it as much, but with this one, I do have to refill it a lot. So I don't really like that, but that's okay. So I have not been vlogging because I have, your girl has been really having, excuse my, my boobs, okay? Cause I don't ever wear no bra. And they didn't, they didn't drop, okay? <laughs> they didn't. 
Aiden dropped it. I have not been feeling it, so that's how my week went. I'm just now starting to get out of that little funk. And I knew the funk was coming, because y'all know how I, I've been saying I've been doing really good. Not getting into, not falling into the funk and like staying on track. And I'm still on track. I just haven't been feeling the best these past couple of days. But I'm pulling myself out of it. And I'm glad that it only lasted a little bit, like a short amount of time. Because normally it lasts a long time. So we pulling ourselves out of that. I got my room clean today finally because it has been needing it i have had laundry that i ain't did i need to clean this closet out i got rid of these old clothes i moved this box out of my room that i've been meaning to do so i got that done <sighs> it took me all day though <laughs> it literally took me all day and i noticed now i can't bend down it's harder for me to bend down and like sweep the trash in a dustpan or like bend over to get something like I have to sit down I'm getting up there and I'm only 28 weeks so I'm like oh my gosh girl we got like 11 more weeks to go really, that's really all that went on this week Tiana's at her dad's house right now but I'll pick her up tomorrow because we have a birthday party to go to we have a birthday party to go to tomorrow my nephew Gio is turning three so he's having a nerf gun party so we got a couple errands to run in the morning We'll go do that. My aunt actually also needs me to do her makeup in the morning. So I'm going to go help her out with that before the birthday party. And y'all know I'm last minute. So I got to go get him a card for his um, birthday. And then we're just going to celebrate the birthday and then get ready for the week. And so if you know, you OG, you know I have always. I mean, Well, I wouldn't say always, but I, I want to say that I I almost always participate in vlogmas since I started, but it has never been like like a set theme or schedule. It's kind of just like what I'm doing every day. Like I'm just participating in vlogging. But I want to make it a little interesting this year. It's going to be me and Tiana's last Christmas together with just us two. And I'm pregnant, which you guys don't get to see often. Um, I don't know. Y'all probably won't ever see this again. <laughs> ever. Okay? Because, child, this is ghetto. But, um, yeah. So, anyways, pregnant last Christmas with just the two of us. and I mean, and Mr. Christopher. So, I wanted to kind of do something special. Like, I'm thinking, so right now, we're not going to go too deep into it, right? If you guys have ideas for Vlogmas, comment them down below because I am making a plan for it now. Because if I don't plan now, it's going to be last minute and <clears throat> it's just going to be you get what you get. You know what I'm saying? And I don't want to do y'all like that. I think that y'all deserve a really good Vlogmas. And yeah, so I've been thinking about our intro. Normally, I just do like a picture intro like I get someone to make me an intro or like I'll make myself an intro with just like words but I kind of want to do like one of those video intros that people do so y'all let me know what y'all think I should do right should I do like a video intro with like me Tiana and Mr. Chris dressed up doing some Christmas like you know and if that's the route that you do decide to pick how should we do it should we dress up should we wear PJs and have cookies and like Christmas? Like I don't really know. I've been thinking about it and I know I don't wanna go out anywhere, like out. But yeah, so let me know what y'all think about that. I think, I'm thinking that I wanna do like the, buy some Christmas pajamas and do a little video, like a little cute little intro with us. Especially with me being pregnant, I want to be able to look back at these memories. Like, I have so many mixed emotions when it comes to me being pregnant because I'm like, oh yeah, I'm pregnant, this is ghetto. But honestly, y'all, pregnancy is such a beautiful thing, you know? And I feel like it is what you make it to be. And I say that it's ghetto because it's not how I want it to be. And then also, like, the body changes and stuff like that. But... It also has its great days and how the joy and the love that I feel with just growing him. Like, I'm I'm making you. 
I am making you I the peppy, okay? Period. That's how I be feeling. Because like that's how I feel. Like I'm creating you. I'm doing this. I do this shit. Period. <sighs> Sorry y'all. Y'all get dragged along with my pregnancy emotion. <laughs> I want to show y'all this pillow. So I got a maternity pillow. Um, one of my good friends sent it to me. Thank you. And I'm just gonna open it on camera, okay? Maybe I should film like a video. So it's kind of compacted in here. I'm excited y'all because this little one has been, it's been getting me through it, but I'm such a procrastinator. Y'all know I'm a procrastinator. I literally have not uh, ordered the bigger one because I was also like, well, do I need the bigger one? Like, I want the bigger one, but do I need it? And one of my friends said to send me some tea. I'm so grateful. So here we go. Um, do it come with instructions because last thing I want to do is mess anything mess anything up and it's got this thing right here do i open this thing like okay it say open close okay so just pull a little stuff right here chris over there fighting demons chris you good Okay then, so that was cool. I like how that just went in there and you can save this bag too, so. Yeah. <laughs>